since 2004, the Legacy Arts Project has been working to fulfill its mission to preserve arts of the African diaspora through classes, workshops, and annual events. The founder of Legacy, Linda Sister Imani Barrett, was committed to bringing arts and culture to the community in order to quote-unquote edutain, providing enrichment to young and old alike through exposure to Africana arts. Classes ensued in Pittsburgh's historic Hill District at Ammons Rec and then in East Liberty at the Kingsley Center, all the while bringing the community together through drum and dance. With a focus on teaching participants and audience members about traditions of the African diaspora, Legacy continued to explore the spectrum of arts, producing and hosting events to honor creativity locally, nationally, and internationally. The annual event, Keepers of the Flame, was born out of the desire and necessity to honor elder artists for their creative contributions to the local arts landscape. 2018 saw the 11th annual event, which honored the 77th local artist. Dance Africa Pittsburgh, an annual cultural event, is hosted by the Legacy Arts Project with and for the community. Started by the majestic Baba Chuck Davis more than 40 years ago in Brooklyn, New York, Pittsburgh has now become home to the tradition of bringing the community together to celebrate the magic and wonder of dance of the African diaspora. And here we are, seven years into the festivities that recreate ceremonies and rituals of African cultures on the stages of Pittsburgh's theaters, invoking the history and connectedness of people throughout the world. In 2010, Baba Chuck came to Pittsburgh to spark the tradition that has now become a mainstay of our community. Plans are currently underway for the 7th Dance Africa Pittsburgh, It's All in the Family, scheduled July 19th through the 23rd at the Kelly Strayhorn Theater. In 2013, Legacy began its international artist residency, working with artists from, or with an extensive background in, an African diasporic country. Since that time, Legacy has hosted artists either from or influenced by Cuba and Gambia. In 2016, Legacy received an artist residency grant of the Advancing Black Arts Fund and was able to send three artists to Haiti for a modified residency. In June 2017, Legacy became a leaseholder of a 1,650 square foot studio space. Located on the east end of Pittsburgh in the factory building, the space serves as an office and studio accommodating dance classes, visual arts, and textile development. In addition, the space is used for Legacy's youth programming, consisting of both Saturday and summer classes. Added to the annual events and youth programming, Legacy has been ever-present in the community, participating as the community drum and dance ensemble at festivals throughout the city. Legacy has worked to eliminate barriers to the enrichment that Africana Arts inspires, reaching out and sharing the wealth that cultural exploration brings. Through all of the work of Legacy, artists of a multitude of genres have taught, performed, or been honored. And as the organization continues to grow, so too does the capacity for engagement of the community. The Legacy Arts Project is on a trajectory to consistently and steadily increase the breadth and depth of relationships with artists, participants, and audience members who take part in and grow from exposure to and interaction with the arts of the African diaspora. Yeah.